story of the golden calf. A well-known Islamic story involving a calf in the story of the golden calf that took place during the time of the Prophet Musa, peace be upon him. This story is mentioned in the Quran and teaches an important lesson about patience, leadership, and worshiping Allah alone. After freeing the children of Israel from the Pharaoh's oppression and crossing the Red Sea, Prophet Musa, peace be upon him, went to the Mount Sinai to receive the tablets of the law from Allah. He left his brother Harun in charge of the people. However, in Musa's absence, some of the Israelites were led astray by a man named Samiri. Samiri encouraged them to melt their gold and shape it into a golden calf, claiming that it could be their god. The people began to worship the calf, even though Prophet Musa has taught them to worship only Allah. When Prophet Musa returned, he saw the people worshiping the golden calf. He was very angry and saddened by their behavior. He remained them that Allah was their only God and that they should repent of their mistakes. Prophet Musa destroyed the calf and punished those who had misled the people. Lessons from the story. Worship Allah alone. This story teaches the importance of worshiping only Allah and not turning to idols or false gods. Patience and leadership. Prophet Musa's frustration with his people shows the challenge of leadership, but also the need for patience and perseverance. Repentance. Even after making such a grave mistake, the people were given a chance to repent and seek Allah's forgiveness. The story is often shared with children to help understand the importance of staying faithful to Allah and the danger of following false idols.